It's a late one, I just had to get ready. I've got to go, uh, oh, crisis at the time. I've got about 15, 20 minutes. Um, just wash my hair. <sighs> Put a little bit of makeup on. I don't like wearing makeup because I don't like my skin to be covered. <coughs> Even though you can get some makeup what's supposed to let your skin breathe, but I'm still not over keen with wearing lots of makeup. But <coughs> I'm going to one of my good friends' funeral today. I've not seen her for years. So I'm quite gutted that I didn't really get time to go and see her before but we don't know we, we don't know what things are going to happen around the corner so yeah so uh, i've got nothing black i don't know whose top this is i don't think it's mine i'm not sure i can't remember buying it but it's black and white I've got black trousers on i've got to wear nice little black shoes but it's just that initial thing of saying goodbye it's so sad and uh, this side ain't gone very well I might put some more spray on it, but um, this side's going to work. Oh, hello. Oh, no, I don't want to today. So, uh, I was going to wear something really colourful, and um, I've got nothing black. I don't wear black. I don't like black. Black's t I mean, I know I have to wear black trousers, and I've got black trousers on, and I've um, rolled them up. Um, I've got my sports bar, because I'm going to the gym straight after, which I think by this time I might need it. But uh, we have to, we really, really do have to go and do what we love to do. Because um, you don't know when your time's up. Do you know what I mean? Right. Uh, it's just ridiculous. I just don't know. It's so sad. We all have to go in the end. I, I, I know that. But it's, it's the actual going. It's really sad for me. But, um, I was going to wear something really colourful, so I might go and change it because this feels this feels really massive on me. Look, how big it is! Look, it's huge. I don't know what size it is, but I might keep it on. It's nice and flowy. It's airy. The sleeves are alright. Got a little elasticated. Well, it's not elasticated, but um, yeah, I'll probably keep it on wear a scarf, not wear a pink scarf, <clears throat> because Julie was colourful, she was all about colour, AJ's looking at me thinking, what's she doing again, she's out in that kitchen talking, come on, he knows something, he knows I'm going out, but uh, the drive, how long have I got to drive, an hour and a half there, an hour and a half back, um, it's got to be done, but I want to see if I can get back about three four o'clock so I can go sleep for a few hours the funeral's 12 o'clock we should be out there by half past 12 we leave about half past one half past two should be on do an hour in the gym I started my son's sanitation fitness um not fitness my yoga poses today oh, my legs are still burning oh Marie you really made me work the other day because I can still feel it three days later but all good stuff I do feel great I smell quite nice today as well <laughs> oh you've got to be happy I know I'm going to a, a sad funeral but but there we go anyway I'll speak to you later maybe on the way home maybe not this is going to go up late today Mothers are angels in training. Okay. All right, I'll speak to you soon. If I don't put any more on here today, take charge of your life. Subscribe to my channel. Be positive. Don't ever be half empty. Always be half full. Um, be proud of who you are. And if you're not proud of who you are, become that person who you want to be proud for. Do you know, do you know what I'm saying? Do you know what I'm saying? Be proud of what you want to become. Subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. Get in touch. I've got my email there. Um, be happy. Have faith in yourself every single day. Be happy in anything. If you can't do... Oh, me and the boys laughed last night. It was just like so stupid. What did Josh do? Oh, we had 
I would go sugar free soon, so Matthew bought some jam tarts and Josh took like the yellow ones, so they're about to be. So Josh took a little bite out of his one and I went, I don't know about that yellow one because I quite like the yellow ones. He went, Well, you take a bite out of yours and I take it, and you can have we swap over. So I took the biggest bite ever, I left it with just a crust. And it's like, and his face was just a picture. Oh, I wet myself. And then we went in and tried to tell Matthew about five, ten minutes later. We told Matthew what was going on. He said, That's not funny. And Josh is wetting himself and I'm wetting myself. And then later on, Matthew did something and nobody knew what he did. And he, he, he farted, but it was a smelly one, and he was laughing, and Josh said, what are you laughing at? And all of a sudden it hit Josh, oh, it's so funny. And then they started farting, so I just let him fart, so I was laughing at him farting, but just let him get on with it. All good stuff. Anyway, subscribe to my channel, speak to you soon. Love, life, live. Laugh. Well, that's it, another one of our little um, gems are gone. It was quite, quite a nice send off, actually. Loads of people there, which I'm really quite pleased about. And, uh, <clears throat> so I came straight home and went straight to the gym. <coughs> I think I needed it. I didn't do too much. I did a 20 minute run and arms and abs. Which is all good. I do like a workout. Sometimes we just need to do it, don't we? But there we go. All good stuff. I just feel sorry for her sister, really. Um, because her sister's, her sister's a twin sister. It's different when it's a, like just a normal sibling, but sisters are twin sisters. It's different. Uh, so yeah. See her sister, her sister said, oh, thanks for coming and, you know, anyway. So I give her my phone number. Probably don't use it, but you never know. Her boyfriend, her husband Dave, I think he's lovely. They've been together for 20 years. How strange, 20 years. <sighs> it's just brilliant. I love hearing happy ever after stories when they've been together. I mean, my friend I haven't seen since she left. Um, she's been with her husband for nearly 30 years. And that's just like mad. It's great, but oh my gosh, 30 years. Brilliant, I just love it. I really do love it. So I'm gonna go home now. And I don't know if I'm gonna say it's sweet or not. I'll just go straight to bed for a couple of hours. About seven. Yeah, I do need to go to sleep. Have some fun. Because I'm working tonight. But yeah, so uh, that's it. We're not here forever. It is quite sad. But I work with it, so I'm quite hard when I feel my heart bitch sometimes. But there you go. Anyway, have a good day. The rest of it, or if you see this later. Love and peace to everybody. Ciao.